Harper, and I will be doing a summary of the, my starfish dissection. So, the umbilical ridge is the, it looks like um, almost a spine on each of the arms. And if you see, it lines up perfectly with the umbilical groove, which is on the external part of the starfish's body. And then the ampulla is the bulb on top of each tube foot. So as you can see, these are the tube feet and then these are the ampulla. And then the cardiac stomach, which I, I want to correct myself. In the last video, I said that this, which was placed around there at the time, I said that was the cardiac stomach. I am sorry about that. That is actually the pyloric stomach. This is the cardiac stomach with... So, and that's the little canal where the food is transferred to the pyloric stomach. And then the gonads, the um, reproductive organs in each arm, the hepatic sisa, the paradigestive glands in each arm, the ossicle and I'm sorry if I pronounced this wrong. Ossicles, ossicles. The, almost the ribs of, if you're thinking of like a human structure, the spine and then the ribs, the umbilical ridge and the ossicles. There's the, of course, pyloric stomach there's the, the pyloric ducts, which are very teeny, but they're the ducts that connect the hepatic sisa to the pyloric stomach. There's the radial canal, which is the um, ah, the inside of the umbilical ridge there there's the ring canal and the ring canal and the stone canal I did not I just want to be more specific this time there's the ring where the umbilical ridges of each arm meet. So that's the ring canal. And then the stone canal, the, calcif the calcified tube connecting the madreporite and the ring canal, this that I'm slight, lightly tugging on. Um, yeah, and that's about it. Um, I'm sorry. Um, if you try this at home, please be careful and 